Some believe the Old Testament writings are obsolete. They see them as irrelevant to our present day. But are they? We are continuing our study of the ancient book of Deuteronomy to obtain guidelines to help us in our daily living. In this series of lessons, we look at the book of Deuteronomy and the references made in the New Testament to Deuter Deuteronomy and the other Old Testament writings. We examine the points as they relate to our day. Father, we humble ourselves before you. Open our minds and give us clear understanding in your word. As our understanding increase, give us the mind to place what we have learned into practice in our daily life. In Jesus' name, amen. As it relates to the connection between Deuteronomy and the New Testament's writings, our key text is Matthew 4, 4, which says, it is written, man shall not live by bread alone, but by every word that proceeds from the mouth of God. To the sincere seeker of truth, both the Old Testament and the New Testament have information that if honestly read or studied, will continually reveal new and deeper revelations of God's love for us and our duties to him. The New Testament often references the Old Testament. In other words, the inspired writers of the New Testament frequently quoted the inspired writers of the Old as a source of authority. And actually, Jesus himself quoting the writings from the Old Testament said, it is written, meaning it is written in the Old Testament. He also said in Mark 14, 49, that the scriptures must be fulfilled, meaning the scriptures of the Old Testament. Not only that, when Jesus met two disciples on the road to Amamus, instead of doing a miracle to show them who he was, Luke, in Luke 24, 27, indicating that the scriptures in the Old Testament refer to Jesus says, beginning at Moses and all the prophets, he expounded on them in all the scripture, the things concerning himself. The New Testament writers use stories, quotes, and special messages from the Old Testament to explain their writings. And among the books often quoted or, re or referred to was Deuteronomy, along with Psalms and Isaiah. The writers of Matthew, Mark, Luke, John, Acts, Romans, Galatians, 1st and 2nd Corinthians, Hebrews, some of the New Testament letters, and Revelation all use quotes from Deuteronomy. Therefore, in this series of lessons, we look at some of those instances and see what present truth we can draw from them. Keep in mind that present truth is Bible truth we need most for our time. In today's time, the struggle between the forces of evil is real. What examples from the New Testament and even the Old Testament can we claim as our own to battle against these evil forces? Find out in part two. It is written.